joined by head softball coach Kerry Winters. Coach, appreciate you taking the time to talk to us here. And just to get started, uh, so it came out today at 10.30, your team was selected to finish first in the OSC preseason rankings. Can you tell me what this means to you personally and what it means to your program? Jacob, I am pumped. Um, you know, this this is a great day for our program for a, for a number of reasons, truly. Um, you know, we, we graduated a lot um, from our last year's starting lineup. We lost six of our starters, seven overall seniors. And, and what they brought to our program um, was, was really critical to our last season's success, you know, in 2021. Um, what excites me, I think, the most about this whole preseason ranking being number one is, is I truly feel as if it gives and shows the respect that our conference has for our overall program and the tradition of Muskingum softball, which for me as a player, um, you know, young assistant, now the head coach going into, uh, you know, year number 12, it's, uh, it's really, really exciting um, and, and gives me all kinds of feels. Yeah, so you had a chance to talk to your team and let them know about the preseason rankings earlier today. What was their reaction when they found out? Oh, it was awesome. You know, it's like when you're watching an NCAA selection show and your team is sitting there in anticipation. Um, you know, they, they, our freshmen don't really even truly know that we do a preseason poll. And, you know, for years, the softball coaches, we didn't have one. Um, so this is relatively new, back new. Um, you know, it's, it's being refreshed um, just, just for the entire conference on the softball side of things. So... Um, started out the conversation in a very serious tone and, um, you know, told them that something exciting was going to be announced tomorrow, but I wanted to be the first to tell them. And, uh, you know, the room was, was dead silent. Um, I felt like I had them eating out of my fingertips. It was great. And then, you know, I told them that it was the, the preseason poll and asked them where they thought, you know, Muskingum was. And the conversation in the room was, well, you know, we lost a lot of great players last year. Um, and so they, they threw out some numbers and I said, we're one and the whole room went crazy. It was, it was really cool. I actually just got the goosebumps thinking about it. Um, you know, we just have a, a group of awesome women who, who they, they like to be around each other. You know, they pick on each other, they joke with each other, but they work hard too. Um, so they can enjoy it for a little bit, but then they've got to get back to work. So looking on to this season, what, what gets you excited the most about the team that you have this year? Yeah, you know, I, I, they do a really nice job. Um, pushing each other in practice. You know, I, I think that they're starting to really get into the groove of competitiveness, um, you know, and, and coming to practice and bringing their game-like mentality every day, which has been really cool to see. That's been something that we've been trying to push since the fall, truly. Um, when, you, when you graduate seven seniors, you usually bring in, you know, a larger amount of freshmen. Um, and so we've had to teach and to help those women grow over the entire course of the, the year. And, and that's been a struggle at times. Um, and, and they've really, risen to the challenge uh we're at a really good really good spot right now yeah so so last season your team advanced to the oec championship for the 25th time in school history which is amazing and this year you're primed to make another run to the championship can you talk about your team's focus heading into the season yeah you know we talked last night um just about how when you put on a muskingum jersey um you know because we're getting ready to head south tomorrow um, when you put on the Muskingum softball jersey, it means something. There's a lot of respect there. There's a lot of tradition there. And with that also comes expectations, um, which is a really positive thing. You know, the, with winning comes expectations. And so um, we, we still have a target and an X on our back. Um, and preseason number one, I think, you know, highlights that X a little bit brighter. Um, but I hope and I, I do truly feel as if our players will use this as, as the right kind of motivation without getting complacent um, and, and take it into Florida, take it into our non-conference schedule and then bring it home, hopefully our 21st OAC championship. That's the goal. Perfect. We like to win, Jacob. We like to win. That's right. Perfect. Appreciate it, coach, and best of luck this season. Thank you.